going to give a disclaimer right here, right now, that everything that you're about to look at is most likely speculation and at the end of the day here i'm not going to be giving you guys a so a totally certifiable information source in this video right now i'm solely acting as an excited fan looking at speculational images speculational um you know rumors about the whole Mewtwo situation. So understand those two things before we go into this. In this video specifically, I'm not going to be deriving this from an actual piece of information or an actual reliable source. So I won't be referencing anything like that. But anyways, guys, so we have a lot to talk about. Now, if you didn't know, Paragon is actually a Smash tournament which happened uh, yesterday or the day before, depending on whenever this video goes up. But um, now, the thing about this is that, you know, the tournament went really well. I didn't get to catch it myself, so, you know, I don't really know too much about the happenings of it, but I did get a lot of messages about the aftermath in regards to Mewtwo. Now, there seems to be a lot of speculation by people who are pretty well known in the Smash community and in other communities that there is potentially the chance that Mewtwo could be revealed at Apex 2015. And if you don't know what Apex 2015 is, it's one of the biggest Smash tournaments of the year. And it's happening uh, in a few days, actually. It's happening next week. It's going to be going down in New Jersey. And it's been going on for quite a while. They don't just do Smash, though. They also do um, other fighting games and whatnot. So that's why a lot of people are saying, whoa, you know, since Nintendo is officially sponsoring this Apex, um, a lot of people are saying that, you know, potentially Nintendo, since they got their hand into this, they could be thinking about releasing Mewtwo at Apex. Maybe not releasing him even, but maybe even showing him off in a sense. It would make a lot of sense when you think about it like that though. Because you know, I mean Mewtwo, everyone's excited about this guy. And you know, we want to see more stuff about him. And plus Apex is going to be a place where, you know, fighting and Smash is pretty much glorified. So it'll make sense for a competitive character like Mewtwo, who's seen in such a great light by the Smash community, to make his debut at Apex. Maybe if we don't even get him released there, maybe even a trailer or something. Now, I wanted to bring it up that this rumor is going down. Now, I know there's a lot of stuff going on in terms of the rumor. I've heard some rumors say that Hungrybox said something about Mewtwo being revealed. D1 said something about Mewtwo being revealed. All these guys, reputable people in the Smash Brothers community. I wanted to make sure that I knew where what was coming from was correct. And there's no way to really certify these things because, you know, I mean, everything's kind of like hearsay, she say, he say stuff. And I kind of just wanted to put this out on the map and let you guys know that this kind of thing is going on. And of course, one of the fastest ways to get information is through Twitter. So I made a Twitter post asking everybody, yo, what do you know about this whole thing about YouTube potentially being revealed at Apex 2015? Do you know anything at all in terms of his inclusion at the tournament? Um, can someone tell me these certifiable sources or these um, rumors that they heard? And this video is basically going to be looking at what you guys said to me on Twitter. I made a post. I'm going to show you exactly what the post was that I made. I made a post asking 36 minutes ago, so were there any rumors of Mewtwo that he's going to be playable or shown in Apex this year? I heard the rumor came from Paragon, which was a tournament that just happened. Let me know. And um, so far this has 8 retweets and 41 favorites. So we are now going to look through my Twitter feed right now at what you guys are saying to me in terms of these rumors, what's going on, if there's any real certifiable source for this, and see just where this whole thing sits at. Because right now this is big news if potentially Apex is where Mewtwo is going to make his debut. It seems like common sense in my opinion. That would be the sexiest thing Nintendo could do. But you know what? It's all hearsay. And it's still going to be here, say, probably even after this video ends, but let's see with our own two eyes what's going on. So we're going to move up and um, look at my entire Twitter feed. So, um, working for video? Yeah, yeah. Okay, this guy, Thomas Juicies, he, he already predicted that, okay, Etika's probably asking us this question for a video. So, um, let's see, 11 days, my dick. And uh, 11 days, he's referencing that um, Apex 2015 is in 11 days. So, I mean, there's a lot of excitement going on. And I got 97 notifications from when I made that post 37 minutes ago. So, you guys got a lot to say about this whole thing. Let's see what some of these sources are telling us right now. So, we're going to move all the way down to them. And we're going to see, okay. So, um, D1 said a special someone. And people speculated Splatoon. But I hope not, LOL. So, D1. I mean, um, he's probably going to see this at some point, but he referenced that there would be a special someone showing up at Apex, but that could mean so much, you know? But then again, it would make perfect sense for Mewtwo. There's so much to take into account with this whole thing. It's kind of weird, man, but I mean, we got D1 confirmed to say something. And um, bro, if Mewtwo is playable at Apex, my dick will melt off. I totally agree with you, Goyle. And um, my dude Kenny's just blah, blah, blah. <laughs> 
Um, Hector Figura says, my nigga, are you going to talk about Apex in a video? Of course, baby, you already know, man. This is what I do. I want to stay on the pulse with this shit. I've been off the game for like a couple of days now, which counts for a couple of weeks. But I mean, I want to be able to find out exactly what the fuck is going on and potentially get you guys interested in something that could potentially happen at Apex. It's kind of some crazy news. And I would love to get down to it since you guys might hear rumors here and there. There will definitely be some rumors rolling around on Reddit. And uh, maybe even 4chan, but um, definitely Reddit. Um, maybe that's why Nintendo is sponsoring, partnering up with them. I could see that. Like, you know, this is common sense. This isn't exactly a genius theory or some kind of rocket science kind of conclusion. It makes a lot of sense that potentially Nintendo is pa um, partnering up with Apex for that sole reason. Then again, you know, there's a lot of reasons that they're partnering up with Apex. But I mean, still, you can't leave that possibility out. I heard rumors that Splatoon was going to be playable instead. And Big N is looking to make it tournament-like. That would be amazing too. You guys, if you watch my direct reaction, you already know how I feel about Splatoon. I think it's going to be an amazing third person shooter game with a whole lot of strategy in terms of those creative, unique weapons and that unique form of transportation with the paint. I would hope that it's playable at Apex. I would hope. I'm gonna be there. I'm probably not gonna compete though because you know I'm not that good right now. But I mean still, I it would be amazing to see that kind of stuff happening at Apex. Um, but then again, no local multiplayer, so unless they announce that too, Splatoon at Apex, it seems to be the main thing. Heard the same thing. I don't know if it was just um, Crossbow Medic messing with me though from Braden. Uh, the rumor by CTR was of something being playable. People are thinking the Pokémon demo, Mewtwo, or just something from Nintendo. So those are three things which could potentially be what was being referenced in that something special thing. So we have Mewtwo, which everyone is obviously thinking of firsthand. Then we have Splatoon, which could potentially be another thing. Very practical very possible and then we even have now Pokken which is um, people are claiming the demo will be there which makes so much sense because you know Pokken fighters it fits in perfectly with Apex in the whole fighting game sense because there's going to be Street Fighter 4 at Apex it's going to be Tekken at Apex it's going to be a lot of great games there in terms of competitive fighters it would make sense for Pokken to be there it would make sense for even Splatoon to be there so there's a lot of speculation man there's a whole lot to go off of all these things are possible so you know it's kind of like you know where the fuck does all this lie like which is more like which is going to be the best the biggest thing to happen at apex i don't know um d1 did say a special someone would be there we're not sure if it means 100 percent youtube in before pichu dlc cap <laughs> yeah pichu definitely is a great character do you guys want to see me do an interview with d1 about this i don't know he probably he's probably i, I mean i i can't say you know what the guy's gonna do before he i actually ask him you know i don't want to look like an ass here and just assume you know that he's going to totally you know not want to do an interview about it but you know would you guys like be interested if i kind of like did maybe not even a like a long interview but kind of like a quick interview with d1 be like yo d so you know like it would be great if d1 even if you didn't confirm anything d if you just came onto the channel and did a quick video with me we get a lot of views people would see it and you know just just confirm with me if there's something worth getting hype about that's all we need to do d just come onto the channel Talk with me a little bit and let me know if there's something for me and my people to get hype about. Because if there's something to get hype about, I want to know. So guys, you know, D1, if you're watching, baby, you got to let me know. You got to let me know if there's something to get hype about. Um, anyways, moving onward. Let's see. Um, figured as much. Hungrybox already dropped the bomb out about Splatoon 2. So D1 said something and Hungrybox said something. So the initial rumors that I heard turned out that they might just be true. We're going to fast forward a little bit. Um, they did say a secret would be playable at Apex this year. Most likely it's Mewtwo. Um, can you start reviewing Pokemon again? Once I move. Um, holy shit, I got a Mewtwo Amiibo. Ha. <laughs> yeah, okay, sure. Um, Euro. I heard that Splatoon would be there. Mewtwo would be hype as fuck. Um, yeah, potentially, yeah. Um, let's move this over a bit. Uh, Etika, my school's hosting a Smash tournament. <laughs> Doesn't really have much to do with the video, I guess, or the post that I made. But still, this is pretty cool, though. Actually, your school hosting a Smash tournament? By all means, that's a damn good school. Oh, it's high school. Um, let's see. Let's see. All I um, Esteban said. All I heard was about Splatoon being there. I didn't hear anything about Mewtwo, but it would be amazing if he was there. Uh, Blue Feather Falcon says you're dumb. We all know this. <laughs> um, Luke Select says took freaking long. Finally here. Oh, the poster's from Nintendo. Oh, nice. Let's see some more. Um, Legendary says, would you beat a pussy? Uh, maybe. <laughs> well, well, I mean, only if it was my girls, because you know my girls, my, my girls got that good. But I mean, hey. Um, 
They said something is going to be playable. Maybe it's Mewtwo or maybe it's Splatoon or Melee HD. LOL. Who knows, man? Melee HD? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, nah. But I mean, still. Livy says, just to let you know if you need to message me, best way to do Twitter or email. <laughs> Jesse says, my dick. My sentiments exactly, Jess. Um, Alan Danny Jr. says, if he's playable, nobody's going to pick him, especially the people who really want to win. You're damn right, man. But you know what? He might just be an X factor in there. Because, you know, if they gave Mewtwo a really significant buff, like, if he's anywhere near what he's able to do in Project M, then I mean, yeah. Uh, let's see. My dude, PokeMD says, nigga, we out to your crib during Apex. I didn't get my new crib yet, PokeM. You got to be going out the way, baby. But still, hopefully by the time Apex goes down, I'll be able to be in my new place. Um, the details are still being worked out right now, but it's pretty much certified that I'm leaving. It all depends on, you know, if the shit goes down. If not, I mean, if the shit goes down, I don't mind bringing you. Y'all niggas come through to the crib, man. We all going, we, we going to have us a good time, man. Niggas is going, niggas is going to be playing Smash Brothers all day, man. It'll be a good time. I know my dude, PokeM, he don't drink. My dude, PokeM no drink but I can turn up though <laughs> I can turn up though poke game oh man let's see um bomber says why not Splatoon characters in Smash would be awesome I'd be shocked that they didn't get in the next game or DLC that's quite a ways away man we're talking future future stuff but I mean still Splatoon is cool um Attica you beat that pussy real good bro screw him screw cooking with Attica beating pussy with Attica is what we need yeah okay fine you want to see me have sex on camera? <laughs> I was already talking about porn doing porns before. Not, not in the series, no, you know, it's, it's all just joking at the end of the day. But I mean, well, maybe. Anyways, um, my dude Kobe, um, what's more questionable is that you missed this. Wait, what? Oh, complete, oh, the typo. <laughs> yeah, I made a typo, so what? It was quick. Leave me alone, Kobe. <laughs> Leave me alone. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, let's see, let's see. Um, more post uh, from, uh, from Matt. Let's see. Completely, completely just how. Let me see. I didn't know Kobe was a grammar Nazi. <laughs> Damn. Let me see. Um, in the stream, maybe around six hours and seven minutes, they talk about something possible being playable. Maybe Splatoon. So there's no real confirmation. No one really said specifically it's going to be Splatoon that's being the special playable thing at Apex. So that leaves a ton of speculation in there. Um, nothing really good to go off of there, but um, let's see. My dick, bruh, what? Sexual monster hunter, yeah, yeah, I made a video about that really, it kind of sucks. Let's see some more notifications. And um, hype, wait a minute, what? Nintendo Australia says Fire Emblem for Nintendo 3DS is coming this year, okay. So you know what? At the end of the day here, guys, you pretty much know what the story is now. You're just as informed as I am. Uh, if you want to get the nutshell version of it, TLDR, there was something that was hinted at being playable at Apex when Paragon happened and we don't know exactly what it is but a lot of speculation is going down and you know we have three very viable candidates in terms of Mewtwo, Splatoon, and last but definitely not least Pokémon Fighters. Those are all things which could definitely be shown at Apex in some form or fashion because they all have a very competitive sense to them. They all just, you know, they all have great characters, they all have an audience, a fan base which is excited for them. These could all potentially be shown off. I'm not saying that they all will be, but each of them has a very fair shot. But I want to ask you guys, which do you think is the most practical? Which of these three things that we broke down in this video, Splatoon, Mewtwo, and Pokemon Fighters, do you think is going to have the biggest chance of making a showing at Apex? Or are we totally off? Am I totally off? Do I not know what the fuck I'm talking about as usual? And are we going to be seeing something else um, hit Apex that's going to throw everybody off their chair? Who knows? But either way, your boy's going to be at Apex, and I'm going to be able to let you know right away what the hell's going down. So stay tuned to my black ass if you want to keep on top of all this stuff. But anyways, guys, I'll let you speculate in the comments. I'll be in the comments, too. I'll talk to you in the next video. Take care of yourselves. And of course, as usual, please have yourself a damn good one.